Alright guys, welcome to this tutorial. Today we're going to be showing you how to make your own custom Sharex location just like this. As we see, we have our own custom domain. We can just go here, see it works, d.calculon.dev. It's very easy to do. Link in the description for this file. It's going to be the upload.php. You're going to be just... Um, this one you won't see it, but it, you will see this file. You'll see this. Um, this is what you will see. Um, so yeah, you just need to change here this your URL. Make sure it ends with this. This is just in case I have a directory in my in my. If you see here, this is my domain here, the subdomain, and then I have a i folder which is here in all the pictures so you're gonna fill this out and then you're gonna save it you're gonna drag it into your subdomain which if you don't know how to create a subdomain you go to your cpanel let's show you here you go to your cpanel add subdomains and you just add like i dot and then create you should see it here and then you will see a new folder like D or I so yeah you just upload it here then you're gonna wanna go to here destinations custom user settings as, as, uh, I mean custom uploader settings you're gonna create new and here you're gonna put the upload the link and then slash upload.php not in here, here is going to be Sharex and then that's really it, make sure it's on post you can do test and you will get this response if it's working and here you go something to note if you are using infinity free this the free it won't work because the uh, they don't have I believe JS enabled or node.js which this needs so it won't work you'll get an error but if you want still to make for free your own you can go to serial web host to this and then here this will work I do have my own custom domain with paid thingy but um, yeah that's uh, shown um, here if I want to take a screenshot of this it works perfectly fine if you do see here we can see and something to note if I'm gonna demonstrate here on my dev one as you see if you just do the upload at PHP you users will be able to see your images to fix that it's very easy as you see I have it on my eye the one is it's blank this is because we have an index that, as you see here, index.html. You can do it by just creating a file and then you create index.html and that's it. You don't have to write anything on it. Just do it so users don't see your photos. If not, they will be able to do the same I can do right now here. You'll be able to, for example, here if you have files, download them. And you don't want this. Alright, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this very short tutorial if you do enjoy it subscribe join my discord and check out my new forum as seen here as i am releasing some exclusive releases like this unique mega pack of like 181 liberties textual liberties so yeah make sure you check this out see you guys